I can't tell you how many of my friends are putting fresh baked bread on their dinner tables as a result of the coronavirus. That is f disgusting. It's 8.45 on a Saturday night, which means that it's a perfect time to start making dough. I'll make dough, but don't call me dough boy. Three cups of flour. Say goodnight to the bad guy. One quarter teaspoon of yeast. Bring instant yeast. A teaspoon and another quarter of salt. Mix it all together, and then add to that a cup of water and a half. We can't wait to bake. Yeah, yeah. Just um, pull it all together like this. Well, that was easy enough. Done. Finished. No kneading. No kneading. Tight. You can cover it with plastic, and then we're just going to let it sit there now for... About 12 hours. 12 hours. When you let a dough ferment and rise for a very long time, it actually develops gluten all on its own. So this is what the dough is going to look like the next day. Got a little bit of flour. Dust my board up like this. When we dump the dough, you're going to see a very stringy texture, and that's the gluten. And for the sake of the home baker, just fold it over like that and put it seam side down, the smooth side up, and then put a little bit of flour. What we'll do is let this rest somewhere for two hours. Are you kidding me? Did he just say wait? Oh God, here it comes. The oven's at 500. Oh, hot, 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 hot. This is the real trick in this recipe. You want those pots blazing, blazing hot. Hot, 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 hot. Can you use cast iron for this? Yes, you absolutely. To, and yeah? you can use Pyrex and just plop it in. And a cover. And a cover. And 30 minutes. Uh, 30 minutes with the cover closed, and about another 15 to 20 minutes with the, awesome. the cover open. Yeah. You need 70% humidity for at least two thirds of the total baking time in order to allow the steam that's inside the bread to migrate outwards. And then this is what we get. Yeah. You Careful. like that? You like the way it looks? Yeah, it looks pretty good. Can't wait. I want to see some color on the top, a good degree of caramelization of the crust. I want to see a nice, nice. dark, yeah. almost yeah. chestnut underneath that wheat, wheat bread. Oh. Beautiful crumb structure, you know? In terms of simplicity, it's unbelievable. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Thank you. I will steal this recipe for years. Absolutely. Make sure that everyone has access to it. Yeah.